All right, all right, here we go, here we go. So um, today and for this week, I found this book on Amazon, how to draw, like a one-on-one, how to draw various different animals. Now, this guy, he makes a ton of them. If you like what you see this lesson, hey, check it out. There's a ton of things like here's the holidays and dinosaurs and and then you go to like fairies and funny people horses and ponies and oh my gosh there's a lot of things anyway so i picked a few animals from the 101 how to draw animals book right and and here's the thing i, I don't necessarily want you to draw all of them and I don't expect you, the one that you picked, to draw it perfectly the first time, okay? This is, guys, let me tell you something. There are only a few people that I've come into contact with that I have met personally that can draw perfectly the first time, okay? Most things, most people, they have to practice, practice, okay? This is, this is what I want us to do this week. Pick one of these animals, okay? Pick one, and I want you to practice that one all week long. Now, I've paused, I gave you a pretty good amount of time on each one you can pause this video and use it and, and practice with it or you can like take a screenshot of it so that you can go back to your photos it saves it in the photos of your device and you can practice with it just just all week long whenever you have a little extra time practice that one animal and then at the end of the week on Friday, grab one clean sheet of paper and draw it for the final one, for the final piece, for the piece that you want to, to display. And, and draw it big. Draw it humongous. Don't draw little bitty small things. You can draw it small if you want to practice, but the final piece, oh, oh, make it large. I have some of the hardest have the hardest time getting you dry guys to draw big why you draw so small you're so you itty bitty you just just so itty bitty i don't understand why do you do that i don't understand why you do that but i digress like i said this is a lesson on practicing sketching practicing and then finally when you get it right when you think you're satisfied with it give yourself a week at least a week draw it at least once a day and uh at the end of the week i bet you'll be surprised at how good you've gotten this is what we're doing today and i would like you now to go and have fun